Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whenever you happen to be watching this, welcome back to another player guys using Football Manager. During this video, we're going to be taking a look at James Madison and his impending move to Leicester City. Now, as a Norwich fan, bitterly disappointed about this and I'll talk more about that towards the end of the video. But I'm going to be going through some of his stats, what he's like on Football Manager, how things could go at Leicester show you some highlights and then give you my opinion on what looks like a movie is going to be done within the next couple of days. But for those of you Leicester fans who have been living under a rock or don't follow the championship, let's talk to you about James Madison. He's 21 years old, he's 5 foot 9, plays in the cam role but can also play in centre midfield. He's a Coventry youth player, so somebody familiar to your area, which is why I think probably he's choosing you over Southampton, if I'm being brutally honest. He was signed by Norwich and loaned straight back to Coventry. Uh, he came back to Norwich, but then didn't get into the first team and was loaned out to Aberdeen, where he scored an absolute weldy of a free kick. And I'm a bit shocked, probably having the highlights showing just in the top corner there. He came back to Norwich after a spell at Aberdeen and... Didn't get into the first team again, but on the final game of the season, he then proceeded to score on his Norwich debut, and that that was it. That was it for, for him and Norwich. His career just kind of kicked on to another level. And this year, he scored 14 goals and 8 assists in 41 league appearances. Those stats don't do him justice. He is absolutely fantastic. He's someone who gets on the ball, dictates the tempo, tries those passes, the killer balls, dictates what goes on. He's just got such good dribbling about him, a good balance, good work rate. And it's just someone who's got a good shot on him. He's fantastic at set pieces. I'm not joking when I say he could go to the very top. And I've, I'll talk about that again later on. But last year, he won Norwich's player of the season and was in the PFA team of the year. So there's just a few attributes to kind of go by. But let's go over to Football Manager and I'll show you his player profile. And as I said, we'll do our normal thing where we holiday one year into the future and see how he gets on. So here is James Madison at the end of the current season. I've managed to use a Sort It Out SI database, which puts in the real life fixtures into the game. And all I've done is I've just moved over James Madison onto Leicester's squad. So he'll be there next season. And here are his attributes. He's a very, very good player. And to be honest, these do not do him justice. Next year, these stats will all increase. But he's got good dribbling, good finishing. Free kick taking is fantastic. Passing range, technique, his vision. He's just a good attacking player. Player traits, gets forward whenever possible. Shoots from distance and hits free kicks with power. He, he's just... Honestly, I can't begin to describe how good this guy is. Leicester, you do not realise how good of a player you have got on your hands here. But we're going to holiday one year into the future and see how he can potentially get on at Leicester City. So, this is the screen I've been welcomed back to after holiday in one year into the future. Leicester have sacked Claude Puel, so things clearly haven't gone that well for them. Let's find out whereabouts they have finished. I mean, they finished ninth. I mean, Jesus. If you're getting sacked for a poor league position because you finished ninth, Christ. Oh, wow. Okay, right, fair enough then. Let's go and have a look at James Madison, find out how he's done. So there he is, happy to have signed a new contract. He's here till 2022 on 52 grand a week. Blimey neck, 22-year-old on that much, Jesus. God knows what I would have done if I had that much money when I was 22 years old. But he's made 21 appearances, 6 goals, no assists, average rating of 6.8. So not, not amazing. A couple of attributes I can see have gone up. But again, nothing spectacular on that. But it's more than just the goals. It's more than just the assists that he offers as an overall player. But that's a solid start to his career at Leicester. It'd be interesting to see how he would get on in future, but I'm not going to holiday any further than the one year. Um, let's see how he done in terms of goals. Right, well, second top goal scorer. No assists, which is quite disappointing. But yeah, second top goal scorer. That's a very, very healthy return for him. So I think that that can be considered a success. But what I want you guys to do now, Norwich fans, leave me down in the comments section what you feel about this. Obviously, I can't imagine there's going to be a single person who's particularly happy about it. 
we need the money so it makes sense for us to be selling somebody like madison but as long as we get a sell-on percentage for the next transfer then i'll be happy because this is not this is not the end for madison i i truly believe that he could go on to be at a club like i don't know man united arsenal a real madrid barcelona and I, i'm not exaggerating on that i truly believe that he is un he's a fantastic player He's one of the most gifted players that I've seen play for Norwich. And look, we've had some good players down the years throughout from my time of being being watching Norwich, which is from about 96. Wes Houlihan was gifted on the ball, but Madison, I think, is going to be a cut above him. Uh, you know, Huckabee and Ashton were great players, but I truly, truly believe that this guy is only going to kick on and he's he's going to get more he's going to get caps for England he's going to go on to be one of the best players he he truly is gifted and Leicester you Leicester fans will understand this when he comes um well potentially when he when he does sign for you but as I said Norwich fans let me know your thoughts on Madison how far can he potentially go Leicester fans are you excited about this signing you know are you are you looking forward to seeing him at your club where can you see him fitting in? I think a combination of him and Vardy up top together could be quite deadly. But let me know down in the comments below. But I'm going to leave you now with a few of his highlights from this season. He's been absolutely spectacular. Some of these goals and assists will really show you what he's about. But if you have enjoyed the video, hit the like button and comment. But most, yeah, subscribe. But most importantly, leave a comment. I want as many as possible. Norwich and Leicester fans, let me know down below so until we see each other next time as always on the channel though adios